Hey everybody, I'm back again with another video. This time I'm doing how to install Exodus without a build. Because of the fact that TV add-ons has been stripped of a lot of its add-ons and it's kind of hard to find Exodus now, but I did find a cool website which shows how to install it and where to find it and all of the addresses and I'll link that in the description below. But right now I'm gonna show you how I installed it really quickly. Let's go. So this is the website I found with the walkthrough on how to install Exodus for Kodi. Um, you know, TV add-ons used to have Exodus as part of its uh, Fusion and then Indigo add-ons, but unfortunately, I, I guess it got stripped out. So I followed the number one option on how to install it. And I did put TV add-ons back on. That's how I found out that the Exodus add-on was no longer part of the package. So then I did a little research and uh, found that you weren't going to get it from TV add-ons anymore and that you had to find another way. And that's when I searched and found the website. So I'll link that in the description below. But as you can see now, I do have the um, Exodus add-on on the top left here and how I installed that was is that I went to the file manager and installed the new path now you always want to check that you have unknown sources checkmarked just in case and you go to your file manager and then you add the source now you, as you can see I have Exodus up there already but I'm just going to show you the path okay so let's put in the path to get exodus back on the box it's http colon forward slash forward slash and then it's cipher and then dash media dot com and then forward slash repo. So this is the path that you're gonna need in order to get it back on there. Now there's two other paths that were on that web page. So they had option one, option two, and option three. This was the option I picked and it worked just fine. So I'm just gonna put Exodus 2 as a name because I already have Exodus in there. Uh, you know, I am just doing this so I can show you the path that I typed in, but I already know it works, so I'm not going to fully install it, but I will show you how to get to the point where you can install it. So, so you've clicked backspace a couple of times now, and then you go to add-ons, and then you click the box on the top left-hand corner, and then you install from zip. And you would pick the, f the one that you, whatever you called it, I called it Exodus 2, and you would see this repository dot cipher locker, and you would click OK. Once that's done in the top right hand corner, it would say that the cipher locker is installed. And once the cipher locker is installed, you would then install from a repository. And then once you've installed from the repository, you would then go and find in the video add ons of the repository Exodus. So there's detailed instructions on this website on exactly how to do it. I just wanted to show you that there is a path towards getting Exodus again because I know that TV add-ons has gotten blown up and uh, I just had a problem with Cellar Door TV uh, pretty much crashing and you know i tried to reinstall it I, I believe if you already have it installed it's fine but if you're trying to reinstall it it's hard to get it back on and uh, so a lot of these add-ons are in flux they're changing addresses they're changing paths and so you really have to remain on top of it if you happen to need to reinstall it like you blow it away or add it on another device then it's going to cause you to do a little research Luckily, the community out there is pretty good about 
you know, logging where things are and, and giving you uh, web pages and different uh, pathways to get there again. So anyway, guys, that's it in a nutshell. You know, I'm going to show the website one more time over here. Um, and I did read that website and it did state that the developer is no longer going to be uh, supporting Exodus and that it will be going away. Um, but just use it until it stops working. You know, that might be a year from now. It might be two. It might be a month. Who knows? But it's a really good add-on. It works really well. It's been one of my favorites. And hopefully it will uh, serve you guys for as long as it's going to serve you. And uh, thanks a lot for watching. If you found this video helpful, please click like because it helps the channel out. And if you really liked it, please subscribe because that really helps the channel out. Anyway, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Subscribe if you want to catch more tutorial videos and much more. Anyway, that's my video. Thanks for watching. I'm going to get the tech out of here.